take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Yes, the billionaire co-founder of Virgin Galactic woke up intending to go to space today, and yes, he went. Along with two pilots and three other passengers, Branson lifted off aboard his VSS Unity spacecraft shortly before 9 a.m. one day ago. Let's help you make your mark. Richard Branson, the British billionaire and entrepreneur, will take a rocket-powered spaceplane to the edge of space today. The flight will make Branson the first billionaire to ever travel to space aboard a vehicle he helped fund the development of Point One day ago. Make your mark, take our lead. Branson's flight today is expected to reach more than 50 miles high, which is the altitude the U.S. government considers the beginning of outer space. Bezos' flight on July 20 will hit more than 62 miles high, also known as the Kármán Line, which is the altitude internationally recognized as the boundary point one day ago. Take our lead. I've wanted to go to space since I was a kid, and I want to enable hopefully hundreds of thousands of other people over the next 100 years to be able to go to space, Sir Richard told the BBC Point One day ago. Take our lead. Real-time net worth Richard Branson owes his fortune to a conglomerate of businesses bearing the Virgin brand name, including Virgin Atlantic and Virgin Galactic. He primarily lives on a luxe British Virgin Islands retreat, Necker Island, which he bought for $180,000 in 1978. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.